from WDTN, this is Operation Football. Hello and welcome to week three of Operation Football. Tonight we will take you to some of the biggest games in the Miami Valley, including a battle of unbeatens between Trotwood and Beaver Creek. Plus Urbana and Springfield Shawnee played a great game tonight and a bunch more. But Jack, we begin the night with our Operation Football Jeff Schmidt Auto Group Game of the Week. Jordan Burgess was on the sidelines in Bellbrook where the Golden Eagles played host to the Carroll Patriots. Thanks, guys. You could call it the house that hot dogs help build. That's because the proceeds from what they call the tailgate here go toward the stadium fund. And the fans who are going to fill that stadium tonight hope that Bellbrook can cook Carroll after the Patriots grilled the Golden Eagles last year. But this year, Carroll's still without a win, so I guess you could say that both teams are hungry for a victory. I just got <laughs> Bellbrook and its fans looking to show off for the cameras tonight. But the Carroll fans were waiting with an ambush in the form of 5'7 halfback Brian Flocus. Flocus takes the handoff up the middle, and they're not going to catch him. Flocus goes 66 yards for the score, and the guy just ran all that way, so that's three more yards. He runs into two-point conversion, 8 nothing Carroll. Bellbrook's offense struggling, backed up against its own end zone. The snap, and I thought you had it. Oh, safety. 10-0 Carroll. Bellbrook showing signs of life though on offense. Quarterback P.J. Eckley rolls right. Nobody there goes back left and finds my man Mitch Roberts for the first down. They march deep into Carroll territory, but on third down, the pass over the middle. Oh, incomplete. And the field goal try on fourth, wide left. 10-0 Carroll at the half. And the Bellbrook band's halftime show was appropriately named Corner. But this could be one way out. Cordova fumbles. Carroll's Alex Oldham picks it up. The crowd going bananas. But the Golden Eagles couldn't do anything on offense. And then it was the Brian Flocus show. Watch this. Oh, so smooth on the spin move before finally being brought down. And later, the finishing touches. Forrest Cordova dives through the trees. And you think he's fired up. Carroll goes on to win 24 0. They say the taste of victory is pretty sweet, and this one is especially so for Carroll, which gets its first win of the season. For Operation Football's Game of the Week, I'm Jordan Berger. <laughs> All right, thanks, Jordan. Next Friday's Game of the Week features Eaton at Brookville. Be sure to come out for the Arby's Lease Catering Tailgate Party beginning at 530.